This is Studio B at Sasani Studios in Balfour Park. Right now it's eerily quiet, but exactly 25 years ago it was buzzing with excitement. A brand new show called Carte Blanche was about to hit the airwaves. Good evening and welcome to our first edition of Carte Blanche. Carte Blanche, all this is one look, said in the book. Well, I just got out of my maroon jacket of top sports. I was so excited to get carte blanche off the ground, although it was more of a magazine show. We had Hollywood stars, we had a DJ, and even an Olympic swimmer. Am I right uh, that your mother sold you? And there's a change room, which is star schools to this very day. Tie you up. Okay. This is one place that hasn't changed in a quarter of a century. The original makeup room at Balfour Park. Having just come from the boys' own world of top sport, I wasn't too happy about having base and makeup applied and maybe threw a minor tantrum right here. I mean, the crew loved it. We had a, a crew of 200 here, and uh, we ran a shift for all of the Mnet broadcasts. And everybody was, you know, bumping elbows to try and get onto the show as an operator of some sort. Do you remember the tension in the control room before we went live for the very first time? Oh yeah. <laughs> I remember, Derek, that the night before we had a dry run and as we went sort of to air kind of thing, there was a total power failure. Can you remember that? That's right. Remember in those days, you and Ruda would write the links. But Anaki, I used to write the scripts for Ruda at times and I remember uh, once uh, I said somebody had a scaphy opti scoa. Yeah. Yeah, it was my translation for a chip on the shoulder and she said you can't write that in Afrikaans. My most beautiful link that you've done was this Dari Tate van die Nacht, Dari Uur van die Nacht, but Klein Kinderkis jou teen die muur laat opbestuur. I wrote that. Good evening. 